Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down another booster cracking, and today we're jumping back into some Wii Cross because I'm obsessed with it right now, and it's super cool and lots of fun. And I've been really, really excited to open up Wiles. So I finally got a box in of Wiles, and I've got another one on the way because I already know I'm gonna like this set. I, I just, I just have a feeling, you know. So I am, uh, I'm pumped to open this one up. It's gonna be, it's gonna be super cool, Su super cool, super cool, super cool. And just a bunch of fun. So let's check it out. We got We Cross here, Wiles. It's one of the older sets, but it looks to be very promising. So yeah, let's uh, crack into it here and see what we can find in this thing. Of course, you know we're gonna be looking for all the very cool parallel cards and things, but let's just crack into what we have in the box as is. We've got some nice punch outs. I still don't know what these are for, but they look pretty sweet. And then we do get a nice little promo card. That should be very nice, of course, at the end, at the end. Patience, my guys, it's viewership retention, all right? You gotta stay, you gotta stay on the video. Speaking of keeping you guys on videos as well, if you haven't checked it out yet, we opened up Unlimited Selector of Wii Cross and it was a ton of fun. Very small pack and boxes, there's only five packs, so it's a short little video. Go check it out, it was super fun and I've already got a couple more boxes on the way, so uh, be looking out for those, but go check that one out, it's super cool. And here are the very cool packs that we will be opening up right now. Let's do it. All right, enough plugs, enough stuff. We've said enough. Now we need to open it up and see what we can find in here. All right, yes, we're gonna get some normal cards, which is fine with me. What on earth, you're in a frog. That is bonkers. Okay, there's a common, common. That is a sick looking card. Holy crap, that artwork is awesome. And there's our rare. We got mountain ice, which was one of our punch out cards actually. And then behind it, we got another rare. All right, sometimes you get two rares. That's that's the cool thing about Wii Cross. Sometimes you just get two rares, why not? And then we've got an awesome, awesome super rare card. And this one is one that I actually got in one of my short videos, so I know it's worth a couple bucks. There is a alternate secret art variant. I believe the colors are a little bit different of this card that we can look out for. It's pretty cool, but I mean, come on guys, this is some great, great work on this card. Really, really nicely done. Next up, let's go. Let's see what else we can find in here. We got this little person picking weeds or something. Very cool common card. Oh my gosh, there's just fish everywhere on her. That is weird. All right, very cool, very cool. We got our rare here. What is that? What is that staff that she's got? It's like a marshmallow staff. That's what it looks like. Honestly, oh, we're showing stuff, we're showing stuff. All right, this is a good LC card. Very nice, LC cards are great. They're always worth a couple bucks and some very sharp looking artwork on that one. Let's go into the next one though. We got an LR card, very, very nice. Looking sweet, very standard looking character, honestly. Kind of confusing what's going on a little bit, but it's an LR card, so it's gonna be a good one, very cool. Let's keep going. Let's see what else we can find in these suckers. All right, what do we got here? We got this person, we got the swimsuit girl. You know, you gotta do it. I don't know what it is with Japan and like floaties, but they love putting their girls in bikinis and putting them in these little circular floaties. It's a whole thing, it's a whole thing, so. A very cool, like, I don't know, bear claw girl. I don't know, it's just a savage girl. It's pretty sweet, actually. Very nice, and then we got our yeah. LC card again. Nice LC card. We'll see how much that one goes for. Not a foil or anything. Ooh, oh man, this is a good one. This is a good one. It's not a foil. It's not a foil, but let me just take a look here. What is this card exactly? An NC illustration. No, that's just the NC. These cards are dope. They look actually so sick, and they are worth some money. And if you get them in the foils, they are worth a lot of money, uh, I think. If, if they don't come in foils, then that's crazy. But this was a very good pull, and uh, I love getting these cards. They're so sharp and crisp. But we still got one more behind it, so let's see what that is. It's a rare foil, very nice, just a rare foil. Wait, is this, it's got a P on the end. Wait a sec, it has a P on the end. 47P, did we just get a parallel? Okay, I don't know, I don't know. I'm, <laughs> I wanna say we, we might have, but I really don't know. This is some kind of crazy, let me just compare. None of the other ones have a P on them, so we might have just gotten a parallel crazy card actually, which is insane. Uh, it doesn't look like crazy. Like crazy, like some of the parallel cards look insane, like really nutty. Maybe it, it maybe it, I don't actually know. Gosh, guys, did we just get a parallel card? If we did, then holy crap, because this will be my first parallel pull, but I don't want to bank on it too much. I'm kind of scared to even be talking about too much and look like a fool, like it's not a parallel, but the foiling is different than usual too. Either way, that was a really good pack. I'm talking miles good. That's definitely gonna be 
a big pack, like no doubt. So we're gonna keep going, and I'm gonna think, not think too hard on it because I'm like freaking myself out if we actually got a parallel. It's really insane if we did. I don't know. LC card though, pretty sick illustration. Wow, look at that artwork. That is something else. Another rare, another rare, just a simple one. Nothing crazy, nothing too crazy. And then behind it, a super rare. Very nice, look at this. Now this isn't a parallel, but it looks pretty bonkers, right? You'd almost think this was, but you know, it's not, it's just a super rare, but it's pretty sick, that's for sure. Really nicely done. Wow, I love Wii Cross right now. It's it's my new obsession along with Force of Will. That's why you're gonna be seeing a lot of Wii Cross, a lot of Force of Will. If you guys haven't seen any Force of Will videos, go check those out. It's another card game from America that is super fun and a lot of people play it over here. And we're trying to boost it up and get more people into it and popularize it some more. Because uh, it deserves it. It's super cool. It's got some awesome artwork as well. And I do unboxing of that all the time. So go check out those videos. Alright, I feel like we're going pretty slow here. So but I keep getting caught up on just the awesome stuff we, we find. I mean, every foil in these card sets is just awesome. Look at that. Look at that. We got a nice LC card. The girl band is back. We got a nice LC of her just playing the guitar, rocking it out. That guitar has a tongue on it. That is weird. Okay, we'll see how much that one goes for, but behind it we got just a normal rare, nothing too crazy here, and then behind that, okay, oh, 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 we got another rare, it's our parallel card girl, actually, so I don't want to spoil the card behind it, but, I don't know, gosh, oh no, I would stop to look it up, we just got full of common behind it, which is pretty sick card, actually, pretty dope, okay, see, this has a P on it too. Why does this one have a P on it as well? What, what is going on? This is just a common though. There's no way we just got two in a row. I'm so, okay, I feel like we didn't get one, all right? And I just did that whole big rant for nothing and I look like an idiot and I don't know anything about the game, which I'd be right. I don't know anything about the game, so. I don't know, I, I, I would look it up, but I'm using both my phones uh, to record and I don't have like a laptop near me, but maybe I should. I kind of should for this game, I feel like just, have my wife's iPad or something nearby so I can just look these up really quick and actually verify what I have. But half the fun of me editing these is just finding out on the fly, honestly. There's our rare card, pretty cool. Another LC card, uh, interesting one. Looks like she's just getting digested or something. It's really weird by a bunch of slime. Uh, weird, okay. And then behind it we got a rare, a pretty sick looking rare, honestly. A little demon girl. And then behind that, We've got another rare P card. All right, see, I don't get it. We're just gonna keep moving on until uh, I really get too freaked out and I just have to like go Google it or something on my computer. I don't know. I don't wanna stop recording though, you know? I like to just keep in the flow of what's happening in the video. There's our rear, 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 our rear, our rare, our rare card. Little flower petal girl, okay. LC card, a pretty sick one to say the least. That one is pretty dope, wow. Really nice artwork on that one. Behind that we got another rare, just a normal rare, and that is some really nice artwork too. Those color, that color palette is such a nice choice. And then behind it we got a secret. Ooh, we got a secret, guys. Oh boy, it's an L rig secret. Uh, is it an L rig? It's just a secret, but dang. Look at that secret. Oh my gosh. Yes. That looks so cool. That's so sweet. All right, we're, we're hitting a good box. I feel like we're doing really good in this box right now. I don't know. Maybe this box is just nutty, but this is super awesome. All right, this one I know for sure is, is what it is, you know? It is a secret. It's got the S at the end, meaning secret. It's got the secret right there, meaning secret. But those dang peas, what are those peas? Besides parallel, well, it's gonna be besides parallel. I think I'm losing my mind a bit. I don't know. I just don't know what I'm pulling here, you know? That's why I'm looking forward to the English version. Maybe these uh, these cards will get on like TCG player or something, which would be sweet. Common, and there's a nice LC card. A very nice looking LC card. Can't get enough of this artwork. It's so well done. Another rare, just a normal looking rare. And then we got another LC card, a pretty dope one, not bad. It's not a uh, foil, unfortunately. But let's see what our foil is. It's a common, it's just a common, and it has the P. I, the more we keep getting these Ps, the less I feel confident in saying they're parallels. It can't be that good, all right? We got a secret and that's the best thing we pulled and that's what I'm going with now, all right? Common, common, 
Beast Girl, and then we've got a rare. Nothing too crazy there. Another rare, which is pretty sweet. Nothing too crazy there either. Behind it, a common foil with the P. It's got the P on it again. I had to check for it. Ah, man, I need to find it. I need to find out. I don't know. Okay, I went and looked. I went and Googled it. I went on uh, TCG Republic, tried to get more information, but uh, the it's not parallel, that's for sure. It's not parallel. Uh, I just hyped myself up for nothing. What we're really looking for are the secrets and the question marks. The question marks are the big bad boys of the set that if you find, it's just an incredible lottery win for you if you find the question marks at the end. The P's, I don't really know what they're going for because some uh, cards and other sets have P's that equivalent to really nice cards. Uh, I do know that from what I'm seeing, the P's are still very good. <laughs> the P cards are still very good to get. They're still gonna have some value, so obviously those will. They're nice, big, full art, rare foils, which is dope. It's definitely not one of the big, crazy ones. We're, we got our secret, and that one was the best one to find so far. <laughs> and now we just gotta look for the question marks, really. You gotta find the question mark, and if you do, then you're in luck. You just hit the big bad boy LC card right there. Very nice. Our rare, she's getting abducted or something, it looks like. Another LC card, a very cool LC card, to say the least. And then we've got our rare foil. I don't like her outfit. All right, it looks like something out of, uh, what's the show? Ladybug? Marvelous? It's a kid's show. Miraculous, miraculous. Miraculous, Ladybug and whatever the boy's name is, I don't know. Kid show, my kids watch it all the time, and it very much looks like an outfit they would wear on that show, except probably a little bit less provocatively and big-breasted, but you know, yeah, we Cross has to do what they gotta do. All right, next pack. Now I feel like we lost so much time. I could have sped through this box, but I had to just meander on those P cards and just freak myself out. Another LC card, it's the same as last time. Uh, another rare, uh, too simple for my taste, you know, we could do better. Double up on the LC cards again from the last pack, interesting. And then a nice looking rare foil, very cool looking card. Uh, I do like the foiling, it's like ripples in the water on these, on these P cards, whatever these P cards are. But we know they're not valued crazy, but they are going to be valued decently, especially if it's a rare. I'm repeating it for myself so I know, but someone, yeah, that's what I want. Someone in the comments, like, break down the full, like, what I what I need to know about the whole rating system, like, you know, rarity system of these sets and we cross, uh, and really inform me on that, because I need to be educated. LC, a dope looking card for that, very nice. Rare, another flower girl, lots of flower girls in this set, and then a rare, nice looking foil. Dang, the artwork is so cool, that is really sick, very nice. Next up, let's go, come on. And let's see what we can find in this one. We got more girls just in flowers and leaves. Another common, and then our girl getting abducted by aliens. That's what I'm going with on that. She's in an ice cream cone. Very interesting rare. And then behind it, we got a common foil. Uh, that's a weird one. I don't really get it. She's getting, is she getting grabbed by the hands? Is she controlling the hands? Can't tell, interesting. Next, let's go. Let's see, we got Princess Bubblegum over there, the rainbow version of her. Common, common, common. And then we got a rare, weird nymph mermaid creature thing. I don't get it, kind of weird. LC card, very nice. Uh, behind it, rare, we're doubling up on that one. We've had that one before. And then, bang, look at that one. Yes, super rare, phenomenal card to get. Ice Storm, that should be good. Very nice, that's the cover girl too, I believe, yeah? That's her, that's her, yeah, that's her. Very nice, this is gonna be a good one, and hopefully get some really good value, which We Cross has not let me down on that before. When you find good super rares like this, they got some good stuff on them. Next up, let's go see what's in this one here. We got the little ice witch girl, whatever, common. And then we've got Elsie, we keep getting this character, but I wanna get her in a nice full art foil. That's what I really want, good card though, good artwork. All right, uh, flower girl again, yeah, sure. LC, there we go, look at that one. LC foil full art. That should be a good one as well. Looking great, wow. This, can't get over it, man, it's so good. 
It's so good. Just brings me back to when I first got into Force of Will. I was just enamored by the artwork. In fact, the last video on the channel was a Force of Will box opening video of one of the new sets that just came out, the seventh. So if you guys sneak a peek at the Force of Will stuff, the last video is a good representation of that. So go check that one out. All right, back into it. Let's see what our rare is going to be. We got an LC card first. She's chopping through some, I don't know, binds or something on that. All right. And then we got another rare. We got Marshmallow Staff Girl. A little freaked out to even hold her Marshmallow Staff, I guess. I don't know. And then a common, common foil, yeah. common foil. That's it. Um, she's okay. Yeah, it's kind of lame, honestly. Watch it be the most expensive common in the set, and then I'll regret everything I said. But hey, you know, character design on that one had stuff left to be desired. I don't know. You know, you could do better. You could do better like the like current. Well, she's actually pretty late too. She's not super, super great, but the design and the art is way better than the other one. So that was the rare. That's the LC. That's the rare. And then behind it, we got a nice yeah. LC. Oh, that's, I thought this was a foil, but we got one more. Bang. There we go. Okay. Common. A little girl in the forest. Yep. That's fine. Um, probably not worth a ton. Three packs left. That's it. So let's get through it and see what's left in this box. We got a secret. Uh, I don't know. Uh, are you guaranteed only one secret in the box? Is it just anything goes for these boxes? Not sure. Maybe we can pull off one more super rare foil. That'd be nice. LC card. There's our R card. And there's our nice LC foil card of this character, which I'm not super impressed with this character either, honestly. But hopefully it's got some good value. It looks pretty sweet. Next up, second to last pack. Let's see what we can find in here. All right. Boom. Bang. There we go. Common, common. She's a cool card. I like her. Uh, there's our rare. I don't know what she's jumping for joy over. Another rare, our lame miraculous girl. And then what's this spot? Whoops. My recording time went up. All right. This is our LC card. Hopefully you caught all that. This is our LC card. War of Brains. Okay. Interesting. And then behind this, we've got a super rare. Yes, we did pull one more super rare. That's awesome. Fantastic. Pretty sick looking. What is going on here? It is. I was going to say, is this Red Riding Hood? And it totally is. All right, so there's the Eye of the Wolf, because I couldn't tell his teeth right there. And then, obviously, the Red Riding Hood. Pretty cool looking card. I like the design of it. Very nice. The super rares in the set are very well done. All right, the last pack. Let's do it. Last one. Let's see what we can find. We did pull that last super rare out of our butt. But will the last pack treat us well with one final banger? Uh, we got this card. I don't know what these are exactly, and I don't know if they're worth anything, just these placeholder ones, but LC card right here, and then behind it we got a little mermaid girl thing, whatever, there, a rare, and then boom, that's pretty sick, that's a pretty sick looking rare, nice, alright, we got the little flower girl in the full art, she looks pretty different from her regular version, honestly, the full art is very nice, it almost looks like they enlarged it a little bit, Really cool though. Wow, all right, that's nice. A good way to end it, I think. I almost went into the polls of the day and then I remembered we still have this little buy box promo card. Uh, so let's open this up and see what we can find in this one. We should get something pretty sick. Always gonna get something cool looking in these. Let's peel it out carefully and then reveal. Boom, whoa, she's pretty sick. Little wolf girl, she's turning. Looks like she's transforming. SP card, very nice. Special promo, I'm guessing. Special promo is what that stands for. But uh, pretty sick. These should have at least like eight bucks, five bucks, eight bucks, ten bucks, something like that. So not bad. Pretty sweet looking. But you know what? I think we got some really good pulls in just the box. We didn't need the buy box promo to get us anywhere because we got some good stuff. So let's go into some pulls of the day. First up, we got this lovely card. It's not a foil, but these should have some value uh, and it's just dope. I got to put it in here, you know. Let's go into some of our rares. These are just some really intricate rares that I find appealing. So maybe they will be an LC card, an LR card, which is a nice one. And then we've got our super rares. Let's go into our super rares, man. These are so good. All the super rares we got in this one were just phenomenal. I mean, look at that. Awesome. The foiling is just so cool. This last super rare we got, really nice, really nice. And then of course we got our secret, our very nice embossed looking foil holographic secret. Ah, very cool card. I'm excited to see what this one goes for. It might not even be available on TCG Republic. Some of the secrets and really rare question ones, 
uh, they aren't even available anymore. Like, it's hard to find them sometimes, so we'll see. But hopefully you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more Wii Cross content. I've got lots more boxes floating around here. The English set that's, set that's coming up in November, I have three boxes, three boxes on pre-order right now. So when those come in, I'm going to be doing an opening of those as well. I'm very excited for it. But in the meantime, educate me on some of the rarity system, and let me know what box you want to see next. You see some of them here. You got some Divas. You got some, what, Reincarnation, stuff like that. Yeah, that's Reincarnation. So let me know in the comments below what you guys want to see next, and thank you for tuning in. We'll see you in the next one.